What's going on, everyone? It's Dodgy Run. This is my first uh, quick capture ever, so bear with me. Uh, my webcam isn't all that great, but this is just the easier way to do it. Um, I'm going to show you guys about App Share. I don't know if you've heard about it, but you can download all the apps from the App Store for free. Uh, what you're going to do is have a jailbroken iPod or iPhone. And of course, this means an iPhone 3G or an iPod. Uh, first or second gen. Also an iPhone first gen. I should mention that. Uh, people ask me a lot of questions about that, so I'm getting that uh, done right now, so everyone knows. Um, then what you're gonna do? You're gonna go to Cydia. Um, while this loads up, it's gonna take a little while to load up. If you guys are afraid, if you haven't actually jailbroken your iPod yet or your iPhone yet and you're afraid to um because you don't want to lose all your contacts you don't lose all your music and videos and pictures and whatnot if you use quick own i don't i don't know if this works for everyone i'm guessing it is because it worked for me i had all my music on here and i i didn't really want to read jailbreak but i took the chance and actually didn't delete anything on my ipod so I don't know if you guys want to take that chance. It probably won't delete anything. But this is loaded now. What you're going to do is go to manage at the bottom of the screen. You're going to have this. You're going to go to sources. You're going to go to edit. And then add. The source you're going to put in is cydia.hackulo.us. It's going to be in the description of the video. Then you're going to go ahead and click add source. Then you're going to go to changes at the bottom of the screen. It has a little clock. And you're going to see three things. You're going to see patch ulos. You're going to see installus, and you're going to see app share. And what you're going to do is don't do not download uh, patch ulos. It tells you do not install right under it in the description. What you're going to download and install is app share and installus. And then once you have that done, you're going to go into app share. So this is what it's going to look like. And at first it's kind of confusing. And um, if you don't download install this, you can't do this, so don't even try. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to go to appulo.usmobile. And I'm probably pronouncing all these wrong, but you get the point. Uh, you can browse alphabetically by newest apps or by newest updates. I'm going to browse app, uh, alphabetically. What you're going to see is something that looks like the App Store. You're going to have all these categories. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to Games. Just as an example. And then, let's say I really want to play Two Across. So I'm going to download Two Across. Um, it's usually $6. This looks like the App Store. Right here you have the screenshot. You have the information, and you have the download. What we're going to do is download version 1. Um, usually what you're going to have is iPod friendly links and then other links. Just so I can show you guys this, I'm going to find something that has an iPod friendly link. Say 21%. Pro Blackjack. Um, this app is actually kind of glitchy. I'm not exactly sure why, but just give it some time to load and whatnot. Don't be uh, all rushy about it because it won't work. But um, as you can see here, you have iPod friendly and you have other links. And usually you'll see Rapid Share, which you see here. And I'm going to go ahead and use Rapid Share because that's when I use the most. I don't have a premium account. So I'm just going to go and use free user. And just like you're downloading something from the computer, you're going to have to wait about 30 seconds. So I'm just have to wait that out. It's really not that bad. Um what this is, it's pretty much 
the same thing as getting them from the app store but for free all you have to do is wait a little bit longer it takes a little bit longer to download but it's really not that big of a deal because you're you know not spending all the money on it uh what you're gonna do is gonna click download then you're gonna get this right here it says download and then it says install under it i'm gonna go ahead and download just to show you what this is like you're gonna have this little screen up here it's gonna download the file it usually downloads pretty quickly. I have an average about about 200 kilobytes per second or so. As you can see, it's pretty fast. Like I said, it really doesn't take that much long. This that much time, 100%. Uh, then what it's going to do is bring you to install this. Actually, what you're going to do is click install at the bottom, right here, the bottom of the screen. It's going to go dark and bring you up to install this. And then you'll see what you just downloaded, which in this case is 21 Pro Blackjack. You're going to go ahead and click on it. And then at the bottom, you're going to click install. You're going to get this little message. It's going to say installing. It usually takes about 10 seconds to install. I'm just going to go to little circle on the screen and it's gonna go to this and then you're probably just gonna say what happened but what you're gonna do is press the home button and go home and you'll see the app that you just downloaded in this case 21 Pro and there you have the app right there it's a lot simpler than you'd expect it's a lot faster than SSHing and the IPA, the IPA method uh, I believe it has every app but I'm not exactly sure on that. Um, but if you guys have any questions, uh, just message me or leave it in a comment. I usually get back as soon as possible. Sometimes if it's a really dumb question, I won't get back to you as fast. But if you guys have any questions, like I said, just ask me. And uh, thanks for watching. Subscribe.